I've been a student ambassador for two years now. I joined in my second year of nursing, so uh, this is my second year. I'm a fourth year McEwen student, majoring in marketing, currently in the Bachelor of Commerce program. I'm actually a third year McEwen ambassador. I am just a second year student, um, first year ambassador. This is my first year in the ambassador program. For me, it's kind of like giving back to McEwen for the education they're giving to me and through service, like volunteering in McEwen itself and throughout the city. For me, being an ambassador, it's being part of the community, it's bettering the community, and it's being part of a group, a very diverse group of people from all different walks of life. And even though we're all very different, we all have very similar goals and ambitions. However, we're all brought together for one purpose. That's to help our community, help our school, and then help kind of the city that we live in through various things, be it new, studio or, new student orientation or hope mission or Habitat for Humanity. The McEwen Ambassador Program is a leadership program that's based on volunteer service. So this group of students is committed to uh, volunteering a minimum of 40 hours of service throughout an academic year and uh, they become the face of McEwen. And it's about supporting other students um, in, in trying to find their way around campus or handing somebody a meal. Every action that you do, that I try and do, is I always remember I'm an ambassador, so how can I represent the school and how can I make it better? I find like most of us can agree that when you're a student, you kind of get tunnel vision and you just focus on your classes, you focus on studying, and you kind of only spend time with the people in your classes. So I feel like this has changed my experience just because I'm no longer just in that little bubble. I'm like, I've branched out to so many people. I definitely was not confident even though I wanted to be an ambassador, I was like, oh, maybe I'm not that fit into it. But they definitely help you build your own self to be able to have that confidence. One thing that we do learn even from like the first day of training is kind of the different leaders there are. There are the more charismatic, like the Barack Obama who can stand out in front of millions of people. But you also need like the more of the introverted type, the person behind the scenes, because those are the people that are probably better at organizing or uh, putting people in different positions. Ambassadors uh, take part in any university event that's happening on campus. Uh, residents move in, new student orientation, open house. Uh, they conduct all the campus tours, that type of thing. In addition, we're out in the community, uh, at Ronald McDonald House, Habitat for Humanity. We've gone to the Food Bank and uh, the Edmonton Eskimo Santa's Anonymous Toy Run. It, it, my favorite moment and also the scariest moment for me was when I was the MC for the new student orientation. It was, it, it pushed me beyond what I ever thought I could do. I always thought I was a, a good public speaker, but it was, it was frightening, but it was very rewarding. One of the times that I knew I was making a difference was definitely at Ronald McDowell House. Uh, when we were finally serving the food, it really, we were just, you know those butterflies in your stomach, that feeling, we're just like so excited and we're like, oh, we're finally done, we got this set. We had it all like in a buffet, buffet style in the kitchen and uh, once we saw the families going on and they kept thanking us and said that the food was actually great and we're like, oh, this is great, this is what we want to hear. Um, things like that, like those little things uh, uh, that shows that they're happy with what we do was really a good moment for me and one of my favorite, definitely. For the past two years, I've been uh, running a legacy project where we uh, group up with a couple group homes from around the city of Edmonton and we take them to Snow Valley uh, for a night of skiing and snowboarding. And uh, the moment that really kind of captured me was the last year when we did the similar event at the end of the night, right before uh, everyone was packing up. Uh, just standing on top of like the big hill, ready to like descend, kind of, it was kind of like the king of the hill moment, you know, where you just like, yes, I completed that, you know. It's a sense of gratification for sure, especially when all the kids around you are having fun, the volunteers are interacting, you know, you definitely, it, it humbles you. As an ambassador, you have the opportunity to really have something that looks good on your resume. It's, uh, it's a great strategic plan for any student. But in addition, you will also get a co-curricular record, which is an official McEwen transcript for your volunteer service. And uh, that, again, supports what you have on your resume. Coming into school, I didn't want to just do my four or five year degree and then get out. I wanted to leave my mark here at McEwen. And I feel like getting involved and being part of the ambassador program is a great way to do that. For me, as a nursing student, we usually just stick to our cohort. <laughs> we don't really mingle around because we're too busy to do that. But uh, I think 
being an ambassador program helped me build those relationships, like you said, uh, with the other ambassadors and knowing what their program is like, what they go through, uh, how their entire like program is going to be for them and how it works around for their schedules. Because I know I struggle, but how are they struggling and how do they work around it? So I can also learn from them in a sense. I would have never had any of these experiences if it weren't for this. So I think that, again, my role here has now become active and it's not so passive. So it's changed my experience completely. Everybody has a different experience, but I think overall you definitely do grow and develop your uh, personal skills and interpersonal skills as well, being able to interact with different students and faculty members. So it kind of like pushes you out of those like comfort zones that you always stay in unless you have to be. And at the end of the day, that's only making you a better person and it's gonna prepare you for something later in your life.